In this video, I'm going to work out an individual integral. We're going to take a look at the integral of cosecant x dx. We are going to come up with just a standard result. This is um, oftentimes an integral that many people will just go ahead and memorize because it's used a lot. Um, however, if you know a simple little trick to do this integral, then it turns out to be a nice little u substitution on the integral. So as long as you know the trick, then you wouldn't have to necessarily memorize this. Okay, so for this one, what um, the trick is that's going to make it a nice, easy u substitution would be to choose to multiply by a form of 1. And I'm going to choose my form of 1 being cosecant x plus cotangent x. And as long as I multiply by a form of 1, I am not changing that original um, function at all. Okay, so that's what the trick is. I'm going to choose to multiply by that form of 1. I'm going to take this cosecant and then distribute there on the top. So then I'm going to have the integral of a cosecant squared x plus a cosecant x cotangent x. And that will be all over cosecant x plus cotangent x dx. All right, now hopefully at this point you can see um, how you're going to use a u substitution with that denominator there being um, really close to that numerator for our u substitution. So we are going to let u be the cosecant x plus cotangent x. I'm going to take a derivative of both sides. So I have a du is equal to a negative cosecant x cotangent x. And then derivative there of that cotangent is going to be a um, negative cosecant squared x dx. If I go ahead and solve for my dx, I'll have a du over a negative cosecant x cotangent x. I'm going to go ahead and switch that to a minus cosecant squared x, and then that equaling my dx. Okay, so from there we'll come back up here and we will do some substitutions. Um, we'll have the integral. Our numerator is still going to be the cosecant squared x plus the cosecant x cotangent x. Our denominator we'll replace with our u. Our dx we will replace with a du over. Now what I'm going to do right here is so that this will match since this is all positives and this is all negatives, I'm going to factor out a negative 1 and then that will leave me with a positive cosecant x cotangent x and then plus a cosecant squared x. So factoring out that negative there then creates the two terms that can be crossed out. So I can cross out the numerator and denominator. I can take the negative and pull it out in front of my integral. So negative the integral of 1 over u du. And then that integrates real easily to be the natural log. So I've got a negative natural log absolute value of u plus c. And replacing that u with what it equals, we've got a negative natural log absolute value cosecant x plus cotangent x and then plus c, which pretty much is your standard result. So definitely, um, thanks for watching. As long as you know this trick, then it turns out to be a nice little u substitution. All right, otherwise you are just going to have to memorize this integral of cosecant x. Definitely, thanks for watching. If the videos are helping, please share with your friends so that they can benefit too. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks.